Good evening and welcome again to channel 48. My name is Spock and thank you for tuning in again. In this video, I'm going to show you Android 10 for a phone that I myself already gave up like one year ago. The other day I grabbed it out of the bag because I saw that out of nothing Lineage OS brought uh, support to this phone and I saw Android 9 ROM sitting there looking at me and I was like what? I never saw this ROM because in fact I I thought this phone yeah we always had ROMs out there you know many developers tried to still create something for us but it were always ROMs real not working camera Sony cam or uh, Samsung cam you had to flash that and then it would not work and, and things like that you know so this phone in fact I gifted up long time ago but today on the 27th of December I'm gonna bring to you Android 10 created today for this beautiful Samsung S3. This model is the i9301i, it's the Neo, and uh, in fact, yeah, suddenly we have fantastic development going on for this phone. Suddenly this phone became a hot phone again. So I'm not gonna make my intro speech too long. Only thing I want you to know that this was done by Roman designer, so credits to Roman designer there, a hey, welcome to the club, my friend. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna show effect two Android 10 ROMs. Yes, not one, but two. Because uh, I as well found the Pixel Experience ROM with gaps built in for the same phone, Android 10. So I have two Android 10 ROMs today, my friends, that I'm gonna show you in this video. I must as well let you know that you can get the S3 Neo very cheap on on, on these on these markets these 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 online markets you know facebook facebook marketplace you know just look it up you might find one as well for 15 euros just like me two years ago so check it out you know if you want to do this or if you still have a s3 neo 9301i lying around then this project is completely for you because besides these two Android 10 unofficial ROMs I as well have for you Lineage OS 16 official development by Lineage OS yeah, and that ROM is, is really fantastic for this phone so you can go ahead and try out Android 10 but if you're not happy you can always go back to something even more you know more more polished and 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 done for you to use as a daily driver from lineage os let's not talk too long let's get started There you are, with my cracked Samsung S3 Neo. Well, I'm running Android 9 at this moment. I uh, iPhoneized uh, this phone because I was testing a mod. And uh, yeah, these mods of mine, uh, they work up to Android 9. And this is Android 9, what you're looking at. But of course, I want to show you Android 10. So what we're going to do, of course, you already have uh, Twerp installed. So I'm not going to talk about how to install Twerp and how to bring your phone from original to this, what you're going to see now. That's not what this video is about. This video is for people that already did that and know how to get around. If you don't know how to do that, uh, look in my list and you will find the S3 Neo, the first video about this S3 Neo. Just do some digging and then you will learn that I made a video about upgrading this thing from what is it jelly bean to to android 7.1 to at that time so we're gonna install the first ROM that i want to show to you uh, 
upper level. The first ROM that I want to show to you is the Pixel Experience that was created on the 16th of December. Uh, it was a very hard to find file, okay, because it's been shared on 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 other uh, yeah other networks than XDA. Although I found it on XDA, but I could not find the thread anymore. It was as well a very crazy link. Only thing that I remembered was that it was done by Roman. Uh, Roman designer. I know that he created the ROM and he has it on his Google Drive so I just shared it uh, as well uh, to my Google Drive so I'm going to give you that link to that Google Drive. Okay, so let's just flash the ROM. Here you can see it. It's Android 10 that we're flashing at this point with the security patches from December 5th. Also, I want to give some credits to Mr. Henrik G. Henrik 09 for Pixel Experience Okay, so I don't know how he how it's exactly done this room. Um, yeah, because I see Henrik in here, and that's a very known developer. So probably Roman designer and Henrik are working together. I don't know, but it's all good to me. Because, in fact, this was the first ROM that I found. And uh, I'm just going to let it install and get back to you when this is done. Okay, we're almost there. And now we can reboot La System. I'm going to show you a bit of the boot up. And then I'm just going to let it load. Okay, we're not going to film that complete process. Otherwise, this video is going to get too long. I need to show even more... Uh, ROMs because after this one I'm going to show you the one that was released today Lineage OS 17 okay so this is very normal the 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 boot screen that it stays a while okay and there we go and the boot up might take up to three minutes okay so whenever we get to the home screen I'm going to get back to you okay and there we are you will get into a black screen and then boom there you are and uh, you will see that the google play store is installed okay we have the google play Store. we don't have so many applications okay but the most important things work such as wi-fi sound uh, recording uh, camera camera works uh, what is it saying uh, deny i don't like and then up here we can turn the camera. Let's put it on selfie. It's a little bit slow. It's not the fastest thing in the world. And you can make a video as well. Hello, hello. Oh no. Here. Are we recording? Yes, we are recording. Testing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No. And so forth. And there we're gonna find the video you see it's all a little bit uh it's not the fastest thing in the world but hey this is uh, android 10 eh? and this as well not done yet so let me see what happened there okay i wanted to see the video if possible and the video is not playing but it's playing trust me i, I tested this before You see that? So it's uh, it's it's a little bit buggy, but it works. Okay, so let's give it credits. It works. It works uh, ninety percent good. Okay, FM radio. Unfortunately, you the FM radio is not working, man. And uh, I can put in a little. Oh, you see that plug here. And then it should, in fact, go to the radio, but it's, it's not. And when we're going to open the radio, it's going to say this function is not available yet. You see, cure. Oh, you cannot see. It's saying currently not available. I'm going to hit on play. 
it will only say it one time here yeah, currently not available so not everything works in this room yet okay but the phone should work let's call my provider my cool Leica provider the coolest provider in the world nice phone i love uh, i love I, I just love it i love the red looks good it's a bit different um yeah so camera works uh, wi-fi works of course you can connect to wi-fi i tested all these things already so i'm gonna leave it up to you to play a bit with these two rooms because it's weekend and in the weekends you always get something from me to to kind of play with and here you can see that Wi-Fi works fine. You can connect to any Wi-Fi network. Okay. Uh, things that don't work uh, are the home button. Okay. The recent apps. So you must go back with the back button. Okay. But I think for many of you that won't be such a big problem. Because many of you are uh, used to flash ROMs that are not working 100 and then you must get around yourself uh you can install all sorts of applications i found out and uh, they all install fine so this room is yeah what can i say it's uh, 80 percent good okay because the yeah the home button is not working and it's working but it's not bringing you home maybe there's another way to get a little app and then you can go home you know so these things you will have to uh, do if you want to use this room but battery life was was pretty good oh yeah uh, another thing that is as well not available that is the mtp you cannot connect via mtp but in the recovery mode you can connect fine to the computer so you don't have to worry if you installed android 10 and you're like oh my god i cannot connect to the you know via the empty via the recovery mode you can with your computer browse into each and every file on this on this phone okay so um yeah much credits to roman designer for creating this you are a legend and uh yeah that made you uh that made you a warrior of the of the of the s3 neo because the official kings of course are uh, lineage os because they support this phone with uh, uh yeah a good version of android 9 that fully works as i already said at the beginning of this video uh the rom that i was on was lineage os 9 uh because yeah you know there are still some things that need to be fixed but uh for playing around this is a fantastic nice rom that works better than expected you know um i would never ever think that 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 somebody would create an android 9 or even an android 10 for this phone so you out there uh, who are whoever is working on this you are legends okay you are my personal heroes and i'm very very proud of you okay and this video is especially for you. So Roman designer, um, I'm going to go one more time into recovery mode. Because I'm now going to show your latest. I'm not sure if we're going into a recovery now. Okay, welcome back. So uh, we are now in a recovery mode. And we're going to install a RAM. And it's called uh, S3VE3. GXX, it's as well out there for the two other models that are as well supported by Lineage OS. So all of you guys, you know the three uh, models of this of this phone, they will all have Android 10. Thanks to Roman Designer. So now we're installing Lineage OS 17, and this one comes without the Google Play Store. Okay, so. I have a GAPS package for Android 10. Oh, no, 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 I don't. I do not. Um, let me see. I should have something here. In 
downloads open caps arm pico let me see what's the real name of this file here i have some open gaps let me see then maybe this one will work let's put this one on the phone let's put this one on the phone this is open gaps for android 10 it's 100 megabytes okay though all right so um we now gonna flash gaps open gaps not sure if this will work checking for digger's file i think it's not gonna work it's working amazing we found the gaps all right this is beautiful this is beautiful i'm not gonna root it okay we shall see if in another video we can root this device as well on Linux OS. Let me see uh, Magisk. Magisk. 20. Oh, I, oh, but this is the PHH version. No, that will not work. Maybe this one will work this one i'm gonna copy it as well this is a special version for android 10 stay awake we are filming it's installing some core apps calculator dialer okay cool framework nice so we installed that um we, let's see if magis works could be that we're gonna break the complete thing now could be mounting system ah smerig zeg hij um cannot mount fender on mounting partitions okay reboot system let's see what's gonna happen Could be that I will have to do the whole thing again. Could be that it's not gonna boot. But it could. It's Linux OS, you know. Linux OS is strong. Strong like a lion. There you go. <laughs> what did I tell you? Strong like a lion, my friend. Roman designer. I'm happy with this guy, man. Really happy with him. This guy is my hero. He is a hero. Who would dream of a thing like this to happen to the S3 Neo? Oh my goodness. Who would ever dream of a thing like this to happen to the S3 Neo? Let's be honest, people. Let's be honest. One year ago, would you think about a thing like this happening to this phone? When we had all these cripple ROMs, in fact, by developers that really did their best and, and, and the reviewers showing their ROMs. You know, but it was never like this. This is like showing something so very special to you, even though it's an old phone. Maybe because it's an old phone, you know, because it's an old phone. This is such a prestige project. This is just, you know, amazing. Even though, uh, even if it won't work like 100% good, you know, if it's like 89, 97, I was saying 89, I mean, 98, 97, 90% good. It's still amazing. Look at that. <laughs> the thing booted up. Hi there. How are you doing? Touch is working. You see that? Amazing. 
This is not some Chinese piece of crap phone. This is Samsung. You know? This is not uh, some, some, some phone creator that is locking their bootloader. And when you ask them to unlock the bootloader, they tell you, we are not giving unlock codes out anymore. Hey, then I feel like, hey, these guys, they don't trust us. You know, they want us to trust them, but they don't trust us because they don't want to give us unlock code. So, in fact, if you're going to buy a device like that, you know, then, in fact, uh, when the device gets old and when the, the company decides not to give upgrades anymore for the device, then, <laughs> then it's over. Look at that. Look at that. Wow. Amazing. So, the first thing we're going to check. We're going to open the phone. This was created yesterday, eh? some hours ago. This was released some hours ago. The screen goes black. Uh, I don't know if you saw previous. Hey, the screen is black. Oh my God. I cannot believe this. The screen always went black. If I would make a call and I would then put in a little plug into the air for, and then, you know, the screen would pop. The, 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 the proximity sensor is kapot, is, is, is broken. But now it goes black, and then? It doesn't come back. Okay, now it stays black. And then I put in a earphone plug. And then, you know, so if you have a problem with the proximity sensor, and this happens to you? You've not pressed any key. Okay. Um, it works. You saw that we could make a phone call. So yeah, the proximity uh, sensor of this thing is broken. So in fact, I want another S3 Neo, you know. I'm looking for one. I put a bit of 15 euros uh, on, on, on the marketplace for one. Somebody's, you know, selling one. So that works. Okay, but all right. Is the home button working? Oh my goodness, the whole button works. Recent apps works. <laughs> I cannot believe it. Is the cam working? Is the cam working? The cam. Let me see. Deny. Let me see if the cam works. Eh, eh, the cam works. Rewind. Selfie. Picture. Now make a picture. Yeah, it's fast, man. But hey. It doesn't register the picture. Oh yeah, it did. It was so fast that I could not even s see that it was... Wow, amazing. So let's put it on video. Testing, one, two, three. This cam is way better than the other. So I think you must forget about the other. This is the ROM that you need. This is the Android 10 ROM that we want my friends my good friends let's see if we can make a recording hello testing one two three four five yeah we can do that so where's the recording i don't know where it's putting the recording yo but i don't care it's all good it's fine it's it's just fine recent apps there we go, baby. Oh, beautiful. How about wallpapers? And what kind of launcher did he use? Okay, this is the Pixel launcher, I think. Okay, not bad. And let me see uh, the styles and wallpapers. Let's go to wallpapers and see if we have some other wallpapers. Okay, we only have one wallpaper, but that is not a problem, not at all, because in my launcher I have several beautiful wallpapers, as you could see in the iOS uh, uh, launcher that I'm using, and that I'm going to use for this phone. And this is what it became. <laughs> I'm listening to classical music while editing the video. And I'm really happy to see this. This is amazing room. Let me see if the FM radio works. We never tested that one. 
Let's see if that one works. That would be so amazing if that one would work. I don't think so. Hello? No. Not available yet. Saved recordings. What does it say? Not available yet. Okay, so the FM radio is not working. Uh, we are not connected to the internet at this point, but can we connect to the computer? And here we find out that we can. Okay, so the first ROM that I showed you, yeah, that was the, the first ROM. Okay, it was created or released on the 16th of December. But this ROM that you saw in this longer uh, uh, review about the ROM, because I'm very happy to see that home recent apps and, and these things that they work, camera works, you know, Wi Fi, etc., uh, etc., et works. Uh, uh, the, the connection to the computer can be established. I mean, like, even the flashlight works. It's it's just beautiful. This is it. This is it. This is the Android 10 ROM that you can install and use. You can install GAPS, as you could see. Was GAPS installed? Yes, GAPS is installed here. Boom. You need to connect to the internet, and then you can sign in to your account and start setting up your stuff or make a backup from whatever you had to this phone, and you will be running and up in seconds i say beautiful work roman designer well done be very proud of yourself because you are world's first to bring android 10 to the samsung s3 neo i really mean it roman designer this what you did is very very special so thank you a million for bringing android 10 to this phone and Thumbs up to you and keep up the good work. To the watchers, I want to say, go ahead, test this ROM if you have the S3 Neo as well. Share this video so other people can as well get it. If you still have a S3 Neo and you don't know what to do and how to upgrade it, you know, just send me a little message and I will find that video or I'll make a short video special for you so you know how to, you know, bring your S3 Neo all the way to Android 10 you know, install your gaps and start doing whatever you were already doing. Like a boss, you know, like a boss on Android 10. And if you don't want to be on Android 10, guys, Lineage OS has an official ROM out there. Go check it out, you know, for three of the models of the S3 Neo. Amazing ROMs that work amazingly good on this old S3 Neo that I really got two years ago. I think for 15 euros screen was cracked but the thing still worked and look today today two years later you know almost in 2020 I'm showing you the installing of Android 10 on the S3 Neo and this is world's only and first video showing this at this point today the 27th of December and that with thanks to Roman designer all right, I will put the link to his uh, XDA. Uh, he just became member of, of XDA, so he has a status that he just, you know. Don't look at that status, look at the ROM that he created. He did it with Pi sources. Go read about whatever he did, and he did it very, very nice. You know, I'm very happy with this ROM. So, yeah, I'm gonna test it out even better, peeps. And then I want to thank you for watching. If you think this video was cool, you know, leave it a thumbs up. The more thumbs up this video will get, the, the more YouTube will promote it. And, you know, other people will as well get to see it and see the magic happening on the, you know, on an old S3 Neo 9301i and the two other brothers of this phone. So stay well. Have a great weekend. Uh, if you're going to party as well, you know, party with care, come home safe. 
so you can see my next video again if you did not subscribe subscribe hit notifications on and then you will be updated whenever I upload a new video again of course as well a big thanks to uh, our CEO Susan Wojcicki for looking into my channel and thank you for everything that you did um, thumbs up to you and good luck with controlling YouTube I say I'm out Fuchi doi